Adderall is not a narcotic, but a stimulant. Adderall is a trade name for combination drug, amphetamine and dextroamphetamine. Both of these are stimulants of central nervous system. Adderall is approved by the Food and Drug Administration, FDA. To treat ADHD and narcolepsy, Adderall, when taken, increases the amount of dopamine and norepinephrine in the brain. Dopamine is responsible for pleasure and sensation, while norepinephrine, which is referred to as stress hormone, norepinephrine when released activates sympathetic nervous system, resulting in body moving blood towards major body organ and away from limbs, which leads to increased alertness. Orally Adderall lasts for 3-5 to five hours, starting at work in 10-30 to 30 minutes of intake. Adderall is taken by the ADHD patients. Since their body doesn't provide enough amounts for their neuroreceptors, dopamines lack leading to the brain constantly seeking for a stimulant resulting in distraction. ADHD patients' hyperactivity, inattention, Impulsivity is reduced by Adderall intake, which increases the dopamine and norepinephrine release, resulting in alertness and ability to stay focused. Adderall being a stimulant is addictive and creates a reward pathway, making you feel positive. Overuse of Adderall leads to drug tolerance and decrease in the release of the natural dopamine and norepinephrine. Thus, in order to sustain the positive emotions, high doses of Adderall are taken, which might lead to psychosis, hallucinations, paranoia, aggression, especially if you have other mental illnesses or depression. Adderall intake have many side effects, which should not be ignored and conveyed to the doctor. The side effect could be heart diseases, strokes, blood flow problems causing discoloration and numbness of fingers and toes, uncontrolled movements, outbursts of words or sound, continuous grinding, and can lead to death as well. One should avoid taking Adderall if they have glaucoma, high blood pressure, history of drug and alcohol addiction, and hyperactive thyroid. One in Interesting fact is that the Adderall abuse, overdose, or usage by students, usually college ones, as a study aid and increase in prescription because of increase in ADHD diagnosis in this age, is so big that Casey Schwartz in her piece in the New York Time Magazine calls this generation as the Generation Adderall.